Hello, Colors. Welcome back to Viva Barca and welcome to another interesting episode where we are going to be discussing on some interesting updates. We start with left back Alejandro Bade. As it has been reported that Barca will complete the agreement to renew the rising star until 2028 very soon, according to transfer expert Fabrizio Romano. We are going to be discussing on that as we progress. Then secondly, talking about this report, let me mean that Barca failed in an attempt to sign this 40 million euro rated um, Southampton star on loan by name Romeo. We are also going to be discussing on that. So guys, as we get right into the full stories, please do ensure to subscribe to the channel. If you haven't, turn on the post bell notification to always stay notified whenever I post a new video. Consider liking the video and please watch it right up to the very end. Earlier this month, it emerged that Barca have reached an agreement with Academy Prodigy Lamin Yamal over his professional contract after he turned 16 years old. The teenage gem is set to sign a three-year deal with until 2026. As it turns out, Yamal is not the only Academy A set to renew the contract. Indeed, as per Fabrizio Romano, Barcelona will complete the agreement with rising star Alejandro Bade of a new five-year contract which will keep him at the club until 2028. Bade, a product of the La Masia youth setup, enjoyed a fine breakthrough campaign with Barca last season. The 19-year-old took over the first choice left back slot from Jody Arba and played an important role in the club's La Liga title triumph. In 33 league appearances, the youngster scored one goal and set up six more. Bale's current contract with Barcelona expires in 2024, prompting interest from clubs across Europe. Most recently, it was reported that Manchester City sent in a lucrative contract offer for the Spanish international, but he turned it down as he prioritized staying at the Catalan club. Talks over a new deal with Bardes agent George Mendes have been going on for a while now, and it was suggested that an agreement was close. And now Romano is reporting that an extension is all but done with Barca set to complete the agreement to extend Bardi's contract in the next few days. Bardi will be signing a five-year deal that will keep him at the club until 2028. Naturally, the 19-year-old will see an improvement in his wages while his release clause amount is only likely to be increased. Once renewed, Bade's current contract registration might have to wait until the Catalans ask some of the unwanted stars from the squad and clear up space on the wage bill. Of course, they need to do such in order to you know, get things done. There are certain players that did renew their contracts. You know, players like Araujo, players like Arnold, um, like, you know, Second choice goalkeeper, Inaki Pena, you know, those guys did renew their contract. Up to now, they haven't been registered in terms of the renewals haven't been registered. And of course, Bade has been an exceptional player and his contract expiring next season, or let me say next year, 2024. It is but imperative that Barca extend his contract because he has been an exceptional player for us. He's only 19 years of age and not many would argue that he should not be given a new contract. He should be given a new contract because he is a permanent left back now in Barcelona. Of course, but Barca have been facing some issues, we know, as to regards their finances. In order to clear out the wage bill, in order to give some space to register players and buy new players have not been an easy task at all. Of course, the transfer window so far, if you ask many Barca faithfuls out there, they will say it has not gone as plan it hasn't gone as planned but hopefully they always say it is the end that matters so we hope that the end of this transfer window will bring some smiles some joys on our faces rather than bringing us sadness and sorrow 
players like Bade needs to be kept for a long time because normally his contract expiring next year will start bringing other top clubs as we heard about City's contract I'm sorry City's proposal the other day and oh my god I'm so happy that the player rejected that and the offer which was of course obviously higher than what Barca can offer to him from Man City the player still had the guts to turn it down saying that he wants to succeed at Barca he wants to stay at Barca for a very long time I think that was a great gesture from the player so let's hope that things will go smoothly in his contract extension then moving on to the next story of discussion Barcelona search for a new pivot midfielder is closing is close to ending as this as said for to sign Otto Romeo from Girona soon however the road has not been easy at all for Barca you know as the La Liga champions looked at several options but found their hands tied due to their financial situation the likes of Martin Zubimendi, Joshua Kimmich and Marcelo Brozovic were all on the club's agenda at some point but they were not going to fit into the Catalan's current economic reality. Before settling in on Romeo though, the Blaugrana explored even more other news and according to Sport, one of the options they looked at was Southampton youngster Romeo Lavia. After spending two years in Manchester City's youth setup, the 19-year-old left for Southampton last summer and enjoyed a stunning campaign even though the Saints ended up getting relegated. Not keen on playing Champions League football, Lavia will be on the move this summer and has no shortage of suitors. With several top clubs in England, Kane, Liverpool have shown interest, strongest interest in Lavia, while Arsenal and Manchester United are also linked. However, as it turns out, Barca too were attracted by the 19-year-old prospect and made several inquiries about a possible move. So guys, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Until next time, bye-bye.